Again, I'm dealing with DPMS. We're going to go over some of the other changes that we've seen with the G2 rifle uh, replacing our, our, our current line of 308s. Uh, this is a 308 Gen 1 bolt and carrier. It's considerably heavy and considerably long. Uh, this is the new Gen 2. It's lighter. It's got the uh, 5.56 outer diameter, uh, and it's shorter. Now, one thing that people don't realize that this actually does is it helps to reduce felt recoil. And how it does that is when you have a bolt that this, that's this long, you get the felt recoil of the bolt traveling back into the buffer, but then you get a secondary, secondary felt recoil as it bottoms out in the buffer tube. With the, new, with the new rifle and the shorter bolt carrier, you don't have that. So it almost sort of defies gun logic in that we've made a lighter gun with less recoil. But that's exactly what we've done. A couple other things that we've done with these uh, rifles. As you can see, these are our Gen 1 rifles. They sell very well. They're continuing to do so. One thing that has always sort of been an issue for people in the AR market is uh, compatibility. If, you, if you're going to buy a gun or an AR, you're definitely going to at some point want to switch something out. In our older models, you know, it was a proprietary free float tube system, um, and it wasn't as compatible. Our new models, with, uh, with the way that the barrel nut works and the way that the, uh, the bore uh, aligns with the gas tube, just like a 5.56, it is actually more compatible with aftermarket parts than our old model. All, most hand guards will function uh, with a slight adjustment to the barrel nut on a free float tube all 5.56 free float tubes will work, and we're working on that with current manufacturers. Uh, all standard 308 uh, flash hiders and suppressors and uh, uh, muzzle brakes will work. All 5.56 pistol grips and buttstocks will function, and the uh, receiver, the lower receiver as it's uh, in the fire control area, is actually more mil spec than our old, and almost all triggers will function in the, uh, in the new models as well.